Sammy Learns to Read by Betty Ward Kane. A new family was moving in next door. When Madeline saw that they had a little boy, she hurried over. Hi, I'm Madeline. I live next door. My name is Sammy. Would you like to play at my house? Sammy and Madeline were glad to have each other for friends. Hey, Sammy, I have a great idea. You can join our club. Dad! Dad! Dad, can I go with Madeline down the street? There is a club for kids there. Please, please, please. I don't see why not, but let me talk to Madeline's mom first. I'm glad your dad is letting you join our club. Yeah, me too. I've never belonged to a club before. Well, this is it. Wait, uh, what kind of a club is this? It's a reading club. It's lots of fun. Then I can't join. Uh, Madeline, I don't know how to read. Sammy, you don't have to know how. They will teach you how to read. I can't read, so I don't feel right being here. Oh, look, there's Sophie. I want you to meet her. Come on, Sammy. Sophie, this is Sammy. He doesn't know how to read, but I'm going to show him around. Want to join us? Sure, I'll help you. Oh, listen, Kate and Dustin are singing Casper Cat's song about friends. If I had a friend, I would treat him so kind. They would be forever a friend of mine. Friends, look at all my many friends. Friends make you jolly, friends make you dance. You're my special friends and that song. Maybe I will find lots of friends in this club. Oh, let's watch Bella and Wyatt play a game. Bella, what sound does sun begin with? Sun. Sun. It begins with s as in silly snake saw a saxophone. That game sounds easy to play. Maybe I can learn to read. Okay, what sound does dog end with? Dog begins with d, but it ends with g, as in Gail Gazelle got a guitar. Hey, this is my favorite. I love the story of Edgar you Elephant. Tell him. I'm not going to tell him. Have you seen the size of this guy? Ellie and her friends decided they'd had enough of Edgar's jokes. That's it. Something has to be done about Edgar. Yeah, but who? Don't look at me. They decided to play a trick on Edgar. Okay, none of us is big enough to tell him to stop, so we will have to trick him. They stood on each other and made themselves as tall as they could. Okay, now Eli, get on the top. Then they cut a hole in a tent just big enough for tiny Eli to put his head through it. Eli looked like a giant. G -g -g guys, are you sh 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 sure this is g -g -g gonna work? Together they tramped over to find Edgar. 
Edgar was sitting under a tree creating some new jokes. Why do elves scratch themselves? They're the only ones who know where it's itchy. Ha, 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 ha. That's a good one. When Eli the giant approached, Edgar jumped to his feet and started backing away. Pick on someone your own size. What's the matter, Edgar? Are you scared of a little elf? Who is that? Why, Edgar, it's just me, Eli. What happened to you? I grew tall, so I can tell you it hurts me when you poke me with your elbow. Just then, Ellie peeped out from under the tent. Boo! <gasps> Edgar jumped back. Eli jerked open the tent so Edgar could see the others. Everyone had a big <laughs> laugh. Eli's plan worked. From then on, Edgar quit poking his friends with his elbows, and even his jokes improved. Oh, they were still corny, but he stopped making fun of elves and started making fun of elephants. Why do elephants need trunks? Because they don't have glove compartments. <laughs> now that's funny. Hey, I love that story. I wish I could hear it again. Are there pictures? Sure, we need to get you a DVD. It has 31 pictured stories, songs, games, crafts, and lots of other neat stuff. The most amazing thing has happened to me. I have been listening to the stories and songs on my DVD, and I have played the games, and guess what? I can read. Can you believe it? Hey, boys and girls, would you like to join our club? Just sign up at firstphonicsreadingclub.com. There's lots of fun stuff to do. You can get your very own DVD and learn to read just like Sammy. Oh, hi. This is another one of my favorite books. I love to read. Write me and tell me what your favorite book is. My email is jaybkane at gmail.com. Come, Come join, join our club, club soon. Bye-bye.